हेलो क्लास फोर आई होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग वेल एट योर होम यू आर फिट एंड हेल्थी एंड होपिंग टू मीट यू सोन सो एज वी आर रिवाइजिंग अवर फर्स्ट चैप्टर गोइंग टू स्कूल सो इन दिस चैप्टर वी हैव रिवाइज सो मेनी वेज हाउ टू गो टू स्कूल एंड टूडे वी विल रिवाइज एनादर काइंड ऑफ मीन्स बाय विच वी वी कैन गो टू अवर स्कूल so uh, few children actually uh, go to school by uh, their own vehicle and few children goes uh, few children go to school by uh, school vehicle or sometimes they opt some another kind of uh, vehicle but few students are there to whom or to, uh, who are going to school by their feet or by walking so there are some kind of and one special kind of uh, picture is given here you see this is a picture of a jungle where we can see there are all green plants are there and here we can listen some kinds of sounds which comes from the birds and the sounds which make by the birds so we have to go through a thick forest so if few people are or few persons are living near by the jungle or they uh, some students have to cross the uh, jungle area uh, while they are coming to their school so this is a description of that place so we have to go through a thick forest to reach a school at some places it is so thick that even sunlight does not pass through it is also very uh, <clears throat> it is also very silent there you can only hear the sound of different birds and other creatures so this is the description of the jungle and few students have to go through the jungle so what what kind of feeling they feel or what kind of feeling uh, uh, comes to the, them while they are going through the jungle as the jungle or the forest areas are usually very calm and quiet because there is no vehicle and uh, there are uh, persons are also not there people are not there so there is no noise or there is no sound only some kind uh, sometime they listen few kinds of the sound uh, or the uh, sound which make by the birds or sometimes uh, little bit other animals sound they can listen so as usual they are very calm and quiet places so the uh, students who are coming and crossing the jungle or the forest they have to face a silent face or a very um, silent and a very uh, calm and quiet place so, and while are crossing maybe they listen some kind of the sound or some bird song or some bird voice or the sound so here are two and three questions given have you ever been in a thick jungle or any such place so if you have any kind of experience you can write here then yes i have a experience in the jungle maybe not uh, not in the time when you are coming to a school but sometimes we go to visit the jungle sometimes we go and roam about the jungle so we have also experience of the jungle uh, lots of you have gone to duar so that is also a jungle or a forest so you can write your experience whatever the experience you have gathered in that place now next question write your experience in your notebook so you will write what kind of experience you have experienced in the uh, jungle if you have any if you don't have then write no i do not have any kind of experience now third one is third question given page number 8 can you recognize some birds by their sound yes we can recognize some of the birds by their uh sound as some common birds are there we know uh, we the crow how the crow crows and the hen how the hen makes their uh sound the ducks make quack quack and the pigeon make some gutur gu sound and few other uh, kinds of birds are there uh, like uh, nightingale how uh, sweetly she sings or the uh, sound comes from quail we know how she sings so there are so many birds uh, to whom we recognize by their sound 
as they make different kind of sound. So, uh, we can recognize maybe we do not have any experience in the jungle but we can recognize different kind of the bird sound. So, <clears throat> this is... Uh, this is this is all about you can write in this question now the very next the um, here it is given moving on the snow so here some students are again going to school through the through the snow and it is given here see how we reach school we go to school through uh, <coughs> through miles of snow we hold hands and walk carefully. If the snow is soft, our feet sinks into it. When the snow is frozen, we may slip and fall. So there is a two kind of experiences. The students who go to school through the snow. So uh, in which area we can find the students go to the school through snow? It, it must be some mountainous reason. Maybe Ladakh, maybe Shimla, maybe some Darjeeling area where the snow become frozen. So there are two kind of experiences. When the snow fall occurs, that time snow is not frozen. That time the snow is very loose. So when they move on the snow, that time the student's leg or you can say their feet become sink inside the snow just like the sand. But uh, after some days or after a month or a two when the, the snow become frozen and they become the solid surface that time they can easily slide on them and they can have a slip on them. So it is a very funny experience in, in those times a uh, few of the students may go to the school by sliding in a sledge type of uh, carriage and they make their own sledges and they go to school by through these stages and sometimes they just by sliding and uh, by, uh, by making themselves slide on the uh, snow, they move and they go to their schools. So there are two kinds of experiences we have learned uh, today. One is in the jungle while the students are moving towards their school, that experience is very common, quite type of experience and the, those students come to know different kinds of the sound of the animals as well as the birds and another experience of the students who are going to school through the snow and as we know there are two kinds of experience again one is the time when the snow are not frozen and they are very loose just like the sand that time their legs become sink inside and another time when it is frozen that time they go to school very easily by sliding okay so one question is again given here. Have you ever seen so much snow? Where in film or somewhere else? So you will write your own experience. Where you have seen this kind of snow? Maybe you are having your real experience. Or you have seen somewhere in the movie, in the cartoon movie or somewhere else in the books. So you will write your own experience over here. Okay. So that's all for today. Tomorrow I will take the another part. Till that, goodbye.